Canada is an export country. We don't use most of the stuff that we produce, particularly in agriculture. So that also means that we need to find investment from global companies. We need to find investment from local companies to invest in our innovation. How does that fit within the policy framework that Canada currently operates? When we think about where is the next innovation, where is those opportunities, we need to look outside our borders. And whether that's investing in companies outside of Canada and bringing that innovation into Canada, whether it's just attracting those companies to come into Canada because we have good solutions, or it's even and taking management practices of traditional practices of indigenous populations from around the globe to bring in those management pieces into our environment because agriculture is changing. The crops that we grow are changing. The way and the demands of consumers are changing. These are all going to be really great opportunities for us to ensure that Canada thrives and ensure that we're profitable and protecting our competitiveness relative to everybody else that we're competing with. We're equally thinking about that innovation system that delivers world-leading Canadian ag tech companies. Canada can do a lot more I think to help support our innovative ag tech companies so they can go out and turn that flywheel of bringing products to market globally, bringing profits back to Canada that then can be reinvested in further deep innovations and so on that can then be commercialized both to the benefit of, of their own future success as an ag tech company, but of course, to the benefit of Canadian farmers.